very low, but this is the Primavera kitchen here in Italy. We got the margarita, the arancini, and a cannoli, and then a whole selection of wines down here to try. We're gonna move over, and this is the outdoor kitchen that we're looking at. So this will probably be our last booth of the evening. Uh, we'll give it a shot. I believe we're just getting the arancini, so we can compare to. Uh, universals today and then we'll uh, pack it up and get some sleep for another day tomorrow all right so we have more arancini we had arancini earlier today but this one has a twist this one there's five of them yes there's a whole five it's sweet and how much sausage. are they each uh, well it's twelve dollars in total so what a little under two dollars in arancini ball and they are much smaller than the I would say they're the same size, but we only got three earlier. Okay, and how much were they? Do you yeah. remember? I don't. I think it I think they were around five or six dollars. Ninety-nine-ish range. So this is double the price. For not double, not quite double. All right, we shall see. But we've been praising the Disney difference all day. We have, and usually uh, there is some sausage in there. I just did a like cross section, so you can see that there's like. A piece of sausage in the middle. All right, let's check her out. There's a lot going on. I definitely get the sausage and like Italian herb flavoring. Um, I like the tomato sauce better here, I think. Um, it all works together pretty well. Um, this is not the worst Italy dish I have ever had. Whoa. It's not my favorite. I'm not sure that's high praise though. It's not necessarily high praise. It's not my like favorite dish of the festival by any means. Um, it'll but suffice. It, but it'll suffice. It's definitely not $12 worth though. <laughs> Hello there. I didn't see you. I'm trying arancini from Italy, right here at Epcot's World Showcase. Okay, the tomato sauce is better than the stuff, you know, and the arancini is better too. Uh, and you can taste the sausage. But it tastes like, honestly, it tastes like sausage you would get on a Pizza Hut pizza. Mm -hmm or a, a chain restaurant pizza. So not super out of the norm there. I'm sure it's just sausage they brought over via Napoli to do. They're good. They're gonna be right there. I'm, I, don't, I haven't rated them yet, but I'm gonna guess five or six, whichever side I'm on. Pretty average. Yeah, it's gonna be an average dish. Unfortunately, it's always average dishes in Italy, so skip it. Food and wine was below average. This is this is <laughs> okay, at least that's fair. this is at least above that. Holidays? Uh, what did we get at holidays? I don't remember. I don't even remember. That, that shows you how memorable these dishes are. So I think we probably got like a cake or something. Maybe the dessert. Yeah. So, I mean, take your time with Italy. Really decide if you want it or not, and whether it's worth your money. All right. So that's a day. Skyliner, we're headed home. Uh, yeah, we did what we were supposed to do. How do you feel? I feel accomplished yet tired. We did all the booths in Universal today. We, came, we went to Animal Kingdom and got a couple of rides in, and then we also came to Epcot. Um, but yeah, so we got the and three booths accomplished at Epcot. So. All in all, a successful day, but a walk. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your patience. We are now resuming your journey, and will take flight momentarily. Thank you. So tomorrow we're going to wake up early. We're going to see if we can get a rise of the resistance boarding pass. That's the plan. And uh, play it by ear from there. Kind of take an easy day yep. since it's vacation. Thanks so much for watching, we'll see you tomorrow and we'll see you